Haha, <laughs> today is the day. Sandy is it. Getting the cam done today. Star 3030 cam, so wiki two into one. We're gonna be taking a ride over to Mike from Torque Custom Cycles over in Hackensack. That's where they're gonna be doing the work. But before we get into that, next Saturday, April 29th at Bergen County Harley Davidson, I am having a meet and greet from 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. Come by, come say hello, bring all your friends. We'll hang out, we'll talk. I would love to meet you guys. Come check out the new bikes at the dealership. And we're going to be giving away this setup right here. I'm going to be choosing one person to win this setup. All you have to do is go to my website, purchase a hat. There's five entries per hat right now. We only have about 40 left. So head on over to www.cycle-fanatics.com. Get yourself entered by purchasing one hat it comes with the keychain and five stickers next saturday we're giving away this sedici bag setup a holster away we're giving a holtzman knife a air moto air pump and one saddleman seat you have a gift certificate there for one saddleman seat of your choice any choice that's a really nice prize so head on over to the website purchase a hat and next weekend saturday april 29th from 9 a.m to 3 p.m i'll be at bergen harley david and we're going to be announcing the winner for that giveaway i can't give you guys a cold start right now it is like 7 30 a.m everybody's still sleeping in the house but we'll get onto the highway in a second also guys if you guys want the best i'm telling you the best riding gloves and boots right here i got the crutch fields on and i have the gauntlet gloves today it's a little chilly only about 49 degrees head on over to www.indyridgeusa.com use code fanatics10 and get yourself a discount let's go see what mr holy shift is gonna do to his bike Slow and quiet, slow and quiet. Don't want to wake the neighbors up. It is a chillier, foggy morning today. So I can't wait to hear Sandy's bike. Is she should get some really good power results out of that 3030 cam. I'm really curious about how that pipe's gonna sound and how it's gonna perform. Because Sandy's been getting really foggy lately with his lowrider ST in the stock fashion. He needs a cam and a pipe on that thing. What do you guys think? Foggy, foggy, foggy today. Let's give her a little rip, huh? better be bringing something real strong for it to sound better than Mad Max. <laughs> he better bring it. He better bring it today. <laughs> because this two into one outlaw sounds phenomenal. So the 475 cam, guys, you know Man, I love this cam. A lot of people, I mean hundreds of you guys, maybe even thousands of you guys message and email me, tell me, you know, asking me what cam should I use? Should I use the, you know, the 468? Should I use a Redshift cam? Should I use a Woods cam? Should I use an SNS cam? What cam is good for what bike? And I've been always telling you guys that on the 107, the 114 and the 117, the SNS 475 is a beast. I haven't seen anything, and that's, and I'm being serious, I haven't seen anything that puts out the power numbers and the torque numbers and the sound just so good, better than the SNS 475. Now, I'll be honest with you, that has a 475 lift. The Star 3030 has a 485 lift. 
So I've heard the bike with a 30-30 cam. Like online and stuff like that on YouTube. I really haven't heard many of them in person. So this is gonna be really cool to hear. How Sandy's bike is going to sound and perform. Now obviously he's not using the same exhaust as I am. They currently, Chromeworks doesn't currently have a two into one for a soft tail yet. Maybe in the future. So that's why he had to, uh, he was looking for other pipes. He had a couple choices. A lot of companies on back order. And a lot of the companies, there's a long wait. Uh, she's running good today. He finally made his decision on a Sawicki 2 into one I think he's seen a video on Blockhead's Garage channel and he liked the sound and it does look amazing. It's all stainless steel, beautiful welds, stuff like that. You know, we'll see how it sounds, see how it performs. But there's really nothing that I've seen, nothing that I've seen that outperforms the 475 yet. But uh, we'll see. I'm really curious. Just the sound of this pipe, the 475, the rope on it, on idle, and when you open it up, it's just, I'm telling you, it is absolutely amazing. I've had, I don't know, probably six or seven different camshafts in other previous bikes, in other 107s, 114s. And I'm telling you, nothing, nothing sounds like the SNS 475. So if anytime, if people reach out to me, And they asked me, what camshaft? Hey John, what camshaft should I use? I got a 107, I got a 114. I got the 117, whether it's on a CVO or ST. I always, always, all three motors, I always will recommend the SNS 475. Out of all the camshafts that I've used in the past, Got a little squirrely, a little squirrely on me. <laughs> That's why you got a rev match, guys, because you can't be downshifting, you know, high speeds without rev match and you'll lock up the back tire. I don't know. I've never used the Star 3030. Will I use it in the future? Possibly? Sure. Sure. I mean, if the numbers come out good and it should sound, you know, absolutely ridiculous it should 485 lift but there's a you know the camshaft is there's a lot of engineering that goes into a camshaft it's not just you know they take a piece of steel and cut some lobes on it you know there's a lot of engineering timing valve overlap lift I mean there's there's a lot of engineering that goes into that little piece of metal But so far today, if you guys are watching, SNS 475, nobody will change my mind, trust me. I've had probably 11, 12 Harleys, and I've used so many different cams, and I've used the SNS 475. I always come back to the 475. Always, always, always the best, best cam. Is that yours? New Ducati? Oh man, whose bike? Nice, huh? Whose? I don't know. Uh, oh, customers. Nice. How you doing? Good, brother. Oh, some heavy chicken strips, though. <laughs> you gotta sand them down. You gotta sand. You gotta sand the chicken strips down. 
Yeah, it's listen, everybody needs to ride their own ride. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Beautiful bike. Gorgeous bike. Getting the doc the doctor table ready. <laughs> Wanna say a few words to her? Maybe she you know she doesn't make it. Maybe the last time. <laughs> yeah, maybe she has a heart attack. <laughs> so what do you think, Mike? Which which what's better? 475 or 3030? What do you think? Well it's not better. Here's the difference I see. So the 475 is a great cam. Yeah. There is that little SNS dip at the beginning. Uh -huh. um, and it does top out somewhere around 5,000 RPM and then it starts to drift off. The 3030 is gonna pull until you let off the throttle. Mm. It pulls until the red line. Mm. That's the major difference. Numbers wise, they're pretty close. I think there's a little more torque out of this one though, because George Bryce does different lobes on the intake and exhaust cam where he takes like two different cam styles and combines them into one cam. Mm -hmm. So it, it's, it's a pretty good cam. Gotcha. All right, we'll see. We've been doing so many of them, he actually set up a banner. Oh, oh. <laughs> I got a, a star cam banner now. <laughs> you, you got a grinding wheel somewhere here? Yeah. You have a grinding wheel? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> don't, do, don't do that to him. <laughs> <laughs> Mike's got a grinding wheel. <laughs> We're gonna grind your 3030 30 down a little bit. Okay. No? What do you think? We'll make, grind the lobes down a yeah, little bit. What? Make our own modification. <laughs> What's what cam? That's uh, that's Peanuts that's, bike. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. a Star Racing 572. 572? Yeah, mm. but I put I did a I created which will start selling soon. Our own engine black engine bolt kit. Oh, gotcha. So it's all 12 point ARP bolts. Nice. Oh, those are the bolts that we're going to. Yeah, nice. Yeah. You got Sawiki on there too. Yeah, that's a short. See how low the bike sits? It's like so different than mine. Why is it low? It's just got no, low. no, I'm just saying compare it stock compared to oh, mine. It's oh, like oh, now I look at a bike like this, I'm like not used to it. Yeah, the swing arm is powdered. The swing powder arm the wheels light. came out nice. I'm gonna powder coat the exhaust on the D and D because it's up. that paint is not made for that. So it's starting to, yeah. So, really? Yeah, I, I took a touch up. On it. I'll show you guys Nadal's Beast 131. You guys seen it already on the channel many times. This thing is gorgeous. There's Nadal's Beast 131 TTS 250 cam, 156 horsepower. This thing's an animal, huh, Sandy? Really? Animal. Looks great as well. Oh, it's beautiful. It's one of the nicest uh, street glides. Really nice. You guys remember I was ripping over by uh, JD Cycle Works by Dave's on this thing when he just got it tuned. Amazing machine. It's got a lot of nice stuff on here. Beautiful bars. Everything's set up really nice. Everything's powder coated. Wheels are powder coated to match. The gray. It's a gorgeous bike. We got the same cargo rack by Hogworks. That, that cargo rack is nice. What's up, Johnny? How you doing, buddy? Yeah, yeah. What's going on, man? That thing sounds vicious. Whoa. What'd you get? Did you get new sneaks? Not yet, right? Yeah, new sneak. No, sneaks. Tires. Oh, not yet. No. What did you What did you get? You got something new on it? Uh, yeah, the, the seat. Oh, the whole seat? Yeah, and the backrest. Oh, damn. Much better. Yeah, it looks fucking comfortable. For longer trips. Yeah. Not like not like Nadal's over here. He doesn't even Nadal there. doesn't even have one bug. Nadal, either where is he? <laughs> where is this guy? 
Either you don't ride or you wash your bike every single day. No, I wash it every day. For me, that's therapy, you know? Uh, I'm in the garage all day. Oh, shit. That one has 7,000 miles already. Wow. And the other one has uh, 16,000. Oh, that's a lot. Yeah, you got, a, you got multiple bikes, that's why. Look at this thing, huh? KZ-1000, Kawasaki 900, Z900. This is nice, Brock's exhaust. This thing's got to sound sick, no? Yeah. Once or what, what is this, like uh, at the showroom over here? Well, these things need to be ridden, man. I'll, I'll, ride, I'll ride them for you if you want. Two of them are for sale. <laughs> It's for sale. The 73Z1 is for sale, 35000 This one? No, the middle one. The one. middle one, 35 Yeah. It's wow. the original. Is that, it's an original Z1. That's what it's worth, huh? Well, look the shirt. One, one sold this oh, year for 55000 at auction. Get out of here. So mine's a little not as good as that one, so I'm selling it for thirty five. All right, so anybody interested? 35? 35, 1973 Z1. 1973 Z1. It's the number 3706 off the assembly line. Wow. And this one too. This one's for sale too. This is a restore that I did. It's a 1978 KZ1000. This one's for 10,000. Wow. What about that one? That one I'm not selling. No. That's my fun bike. You gotta ride it. Axel. What axle? You got there, buddy. Munchies, tuna oh, fish salad tuna? Nice. with cream cheese scallions. Oh damn! On an everything bagel. And what do you what do you got over here? A little lox spread? Yeah, just because Nadal <clears throat> wants it. I don't I don't do lox. Oh yeah, well, come on, you gotta have lox spread, dude. I'm not Jewish. I don't like lox. You're not Jewish? <laughs> <laughs> Did you ever hear of a Jew that doesn't like lox? Or bagels? Or oh, bagels? <laughs> I love bagels. Oh, holy cow, Sandy bought bagels for the whole town. <laughs> Look at that. Jeez. You're making me hungry. I'm gonna have to have one. one. Have one. Let's 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 make a bagel. A right. cup of coffee. A cup, a cup of coffee. Get a cup of coffee, brother. <laughs> a cup of coffee. Cup of coffee. Cup of coffee in the big time, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Cup of coffee in the big time, yeah. Exactly. <laughs> oh, Sandy, dude, they're hot, hot and delicious. Look at that. I'm, I'm telling you, you're not, you're not hey. gonna get a better bagel than New Jersey. I don't care well, what anybody there's an says. There's an everything bagel. I don't want everything. Look at my, my, come on. That's caca. That's, that's <laughs> great. <laughs> <laughs> That's caca. What what better in the morning than a bagel, a New Jersey style bagel? I'm telling you, come New to Jersey is the capital of bagels. I believe it. Uh huh. It's I, t I tell everybody it's something probably in the water. Bagel time. Bagel. Cup of coffee. It's a cup of coffee in the big time. What's the matter? No. Is this tuna, Sandy, or chicken salad? I thought it said tuna, <sighs> but. It I don't know what it tastes like. It tastes like some. You don't know what it between. tastes like? <laughs> no, I think it's somewhere in between. <laughs> Damn. Flying ride's pretty sick, huh? The whole family. Jeez. Crazy. Good thing we didn't go out with you uh, last weekend. You would have got all of us sick. <laughs> it was a disgrace concert. Yeah, that's what it was. Yeah, but then we were supposed to go riding the next day. Bruce got, got it too, I think. <laughs> yeah, Bruce, got it. Bruce Springsteen gave it to him. He's the super for the whole freaking arena. Super spreader. <laughs> Bruce Springsteen, you gave uh, Fly and Ride COVID. Only one person at a time in the bathroom, by the way. Oh, yeah, we don't share. <laughs> Hung a sign, please, only one person at a time in the bathroom. <laughs> yeah, that's a, that's a little strange. Who's your guest, sir? I'm sure you've. You got the bolt cutters? We ain't cutting them. That's a picture. We're no? Taking tops off. Hmm? Oh, we're taking top off, you're right. Taking the top off. Oh, why are you changing the springs? <laughs> oh, you are. Springs. It's the best thing to do because the stock springs suck on those yeah. bikes. You don't want to take the chance at it. Yeah, to get Jerry. the axle out. So, uh, it's, good. it's jammed, it's stuck in there in the bearings. We'll get it out. I'm going to have to heat it up. So, like everybody says, 45 is like the max lift. You could go without changing them, but you, 45, you, would, I do. you would still change it? We bulletproof everything. Like when we pull the top off, Harley has bolts that hold the rocker shafts down. Mm -hmm. We're gonna take those out, replace them with studs and and ARP nuts. Rocker arms are on back order till June. 
So Eddie had to step up and I put SNS Roller Rockers in. He's in the building. How you doing, Mike? <laughs> I made you before? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. My man, how you been, brother? Good, good, how you doing? Good, good. You look great. Good. Not you look good, good brother. Thanks. Not bless you. The old whole wheat, right there inside. Got you one of each. Yeah. How you been, brother? Good. How you feeling? Yeah. Okay, all right. Yeah, you look good. Five. I was. A, I, I was. So what? Uh, Nadal's got. I got. Believe it or not, that's why I tell you guys, health is important. Yeah, you gotta start early. I eat pretty healthy. My cholesterol is at two forty. But I'm at that. My good cholesterols are good. And you're what? Two, I mean, three? My bad cholesterol was at 300. The bad and, one. And then Mike goes, what? You're amateurs? You're amateurs. Because <laughs> the last blood work I got, they couldn't read my cholesterol because my triglycerides were over 7,000. Wow. Whoa. <laughs> what? Yeah. Keep eating bacon. Wait, it's all yeah. Yeah. Well, no, it's yeah. safe. My so when, so when they say, what's your blood type, you just say ragu. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, shit. <laughs> you heard that one before? Oh, my God. <laughs> I feel... I, they go, Do Dr. asks Mike, what's your blood type? He goes, it's just ragu. You're going to have to get an extra pump to work his blood through his body. <laughs> he needs an S&S &S pump. How <laughs> <laughs> your blood? Holy it's cow, 7,000, damn. See, I feel uncomfortable. What's yours at? What's yours I feel at? uncomfortable with this conversation. What's yours at? 92. <laughs> is it really? No. Oh, you don't even you don't know? I do. It's around 180, 180. Oh, that's that's yeah, good. It's yeah, under yeah. under 200. Yeah. That's great. That's why you need your exam, get your blood work done every year so you have a baseline. Yeah. There's a link down oh, by the oh, description. There's a link <laughs> down by the description. <laughs> Sandy will check your blood. We'll take you for a plane ride. Yeah. Uh, if you're messed up, this is my it's nice. It. So this is Sandy's like 30 30 party. It's my party. <laughs> my party. It's his party. It's my party. And you're invited. Party. You're invited. Was 30, 30 yeah. <laughs> yeah. The 30 30 party. He's having a camshaft party. Where's all the booze, Sandy? Last time I see you, I was So unfortunately, I can't uh, stay here for the entire <clears throat> install, but definitely head on over to. Uh, Sandy's channel, Holy Shift, you could check out the whole video on his channel. Um, but I will at the end of this video. Are you are you guys gonna be done with it today or no? We should not soon, but we should have it back together around the set. Oh, okay. Sandy's taking it home today or no? No. Yeah. yeah. Oh, you are? Barring any incidents. So stop oh, by my house. I will. I wanna because I want to hear the dirty 30. Dirty 30. And here we go. Patient is in the room and uh the team is here. Scalpel. <laughs> Scalpel. There you go. <laughs> Gotta rip everything. Oxygen mic. You got the chainsaw? Oh yeah, these are spoken. Because I'm doing one on uh, I'm doing I'm one on put my, I'm putting one on my bike. I'm doing the one on What are you checking my ears? My my, my hair? <laughs> Look. And then I just gotta flip it on the tech that research. Just flip I it. I have on. that one. The 131 is the hardest come with that oil. What else are you doing, Sandy? You're doing some love jug yeah, action, jugs. You know, I've seen uh, at the time Amsoil Adam or really? Adam Amsoil. At the time we were at the rally together, yeah. and I see I've seen his display with the bikes running all day long. Right. That's just and second thing is I remember your bike smoking, silverback smoking. Overheated. With, yes. Yeah, overheated right. at the time, and it was a bigger yeah, display. That's good. Than, nice. Yeah. The tank, I guess, more air. No, uh, it's a Ducati. I know. I, I, it's nice. I can't say anything. I have it. The way this thing is built, man. This is like the best bike you can It's made. like <laughs> delicioso. So, <laughs> right, Nadal? Uh, I'll put this up here also. So you took your video here, right? Yeah. So I'm going to consolidate now. And then I usually so, lay stuff what, out what, up here. Tell me, what is, what is he using? And then I'll get, get out of your hair. We got a uh, SNS pump and plate. Uh huh. Fueling race lifters. Uh, fueling makes a really nice want, fueling makes a really nice gasket set. It's it is a Kometic gasket set from from Kometic, which gives you everything you need for the that's top the end. company, right? Yeah, they make good gasket sets. Comes right? with uh -huh. the cam bearing, 
Right. Comes with new ARP style bolts for your for your oh, crank nice. and cam. Oh, the whole kit. Yeah, everything. And that's the Timken cam, but that's the yep. best one here. And then we've got we we bulletproof these motors as best as we can. So fueling also makes a hardened pinion gear. Um, make a hardened pinion gear to replace the stock one, like my hundred and fifty dollar snap on knife. <laughs> that's it. That's it. <laughs> Just 12 payments of $10 a week. <laughs> that, that'd be one 12 payments of $2,000 and you got yourself a snap-on knife. So this uh, is the, the hardened yeah. press-on gear that gotcha. Fueling makes, which then we give the old gears back to the customers. They usually make keychains out of them. There you go. Um, and then that's SNS tensioner, cam right. chain tensioner. Mm -hmm. Doesn't have to be changed. I mean, the Harley right. one's okay, but I do it. These are the tappet blocks. Um, the Harley ones are, these are anti-rotational devices for the mm, lifters. Right. Harleys are plastic. So these get replaced with a nice mm. aluminum style. These are the studs and ARP bolts that are gonna replace the rocker bolts that go in. Mm -hmm. uh, Harley uses a, this is Harley's bolt. Right. These tend to walk out. Uh, so the stud and nut combination is better. Gotcha. Fueling. Solid push rods. Solid because you're lifting off so, the head. Yep. We're gonna lift off the head now. Yeah, right. Uh, Other, otherwise, otherwise you're you cutting them and doing adjustments. I like right. doing these because it's one less thing that can go wrong. Right. Right. And if you're operating with a camshaft that's got a stock base circle, right, you can use these. The only time that you can't use these, even if you're pulling the head off, mm -hmm. is if you've got a radical cam that the base circle isn't the same size as the Harley mm -hmm. base circle. Gotcha. This Star Racing cam, all of George Bryce's cams have uh, stock Harley base circles. And when I say the base circle, I mean the lowest point of the cam. Mm -hmm. So at the lowest point, the measurement, the solid push rods will work. You don't need the adjustables. Nice. Okay. Um, this cam. Let me let me grind this down for Sam. No, 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 you don't. <laughs> Where's that grinding wheel? I'll, I'll make, we'll make our own cam. The cycle fanatics, <laughs> maybe dirty forty. <laughs> when we pull his cam out, we'll do a we'll do a short. Uh, you'll see how tall, how much right, taller right, and right. wider. Uh -huh. So the duration of this duration, cam is longer right. and, and the peak. The lift. Yep. Mm. Nice. And then we were gonna be doing SNS uh, oh, valve springs. springs. Nice. Oh, Not dude. Yeah. Now, you, now you're gonna be a boss. Baller. Now you're gonna be a boss. <laughs> now he's gonna be a baller. Now, now you're like a, a kid on a tricycle, but now, you know, in a couple we're, hours, you're gonna... <laughs> we're, taking, we're taking the training wheels off now. Today, today, do we have Sam's base rails yesterday? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you did it. Let's Good. go. Let's. The numbers are fine, but I didn't get an accurate air fuel. It seemed like it was running extremely rich. All right. So run one, 91 horsepower and 111.9 torque. Mm. Not bad torque. Yeah. Now as the bike heated up, 92 and 112, 93 and 113, and then. At Operating temperature, 94 and 113. Wow, that's, that's nice numbers. For stock, not bad. No, yeah, but actually with the slip-ons. Okay? With the slip-ons. Slip now, Milo Rider ST, Milo Rider ST <laughs> was very close with my two into one Bassani. Uh -huh. All right, so I'm out. Guys, good luck. Good luck, Sandy. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> You're not staying for the work. Ah, you I, just can't, come, I can't, I can't. But you, you will stop by later, right? Yeah. Yeah.